hello beautiful welcome back to my channel my name is tracy and today i have a plan with me for the week of november 19th through november 25th it is the week of thanksgiving and this kit autumn breeze by jacks and pepper was the closest thing i had in my collection to a thanksgiving kit i just didn't want to spend any extra money on a thanksgiving kit specifically so we're using this beautiful four page kit from jacks and pepper it is so gorgeous with all of the corals the oranges and the dark blues and the deep berries and the leaves i just thought it would be perfect i am planning quite differently this week by the way this is only the mini kit the kit actually has six pages but i only purchased four on one of her two dollar tuesdays i will link her instagram page and her shopify in the description box below she has great two dollar tuesday so i decided to build the sidebar with the items that the kit had in it you guys know i'm trying to get better at my nutrition and my fitness so i decided to use the monday through sunday tracker as uh, my step tracker i normally put it along the bottom bar but we're going to put it on the sidebar today i used that little half foot <laughs> from the honeybee shop and wrote steps on one of the pieces of washi from the kit then we went up with the hydration sticker which is something i'm definitely definitely working on and plan to get much much better at it then i use two habit trackers one for taking my vitamins and one for tracking the days i do yoga the full box kit at the very top says i can smell autumn dancing in the breeze it is such a beautiful beautiful um full box then i went in with a flag that was from the kit as well to cover up the blue and the erin condren this kit came with um date covers which i really do like i really like having date covers with my kids most of them really don't have date covers, but I do enjoy them. These were so pretty, and I just felt like it tied the kit together very well. And then I went in with all of the today headers across the top of each day. I'm just going to work on Monday through Wednesday to begin with. So after that, I'm going in with half boxes so I can mark the days that I have to work my daytime job. You guys know typically I'm off on Mondays, but because this is the week of Thanksgiving, I have to make sure that I work 18 hours because I get six hours for Thanksgiving and six hours for Black Friday. So I wanted to work on Monday so I wouldn't have to have so many hours on Tuesday and Wednesday. After I lay down those half boxes, I'm going in with the work script lettering from gp sticker studio i really love how this particular work script sticker ties in all of my spreads so far i bought three sheets when i bought them the very first time and i'm very happy that i did i am having coffee obviously on monday morning we know the drill every work day i like to have coffee first thing in the morning um, I did a little moving around because I put that quarter box there. I have a therapy appointment before I go to work at 8 o'clock. So I kind of had to get that little therapy sticker in. And that is from the Honey Bee Shop. The coffee cup is from the kit. Then I'm going in with a full box to take up the chunk of space that I'll be at work. But I'm planning on filming my regular Monday vlog that I call Happy Monday. <laughs> so I put a film sticker from Hello. I think it's Oh Hello Stationery Co. Um, on top of that full box. My to-dos for Monday were to clean the kitchen, make potato soup, and pick up some sparkling cider for thanksgiving dinner now i was able to get all of those things done potato soup was really good i ended up putting it in a crock pot <laughs> it turned out really good though and per usual you guys i put a pair of glasses at the bottom of monday but you know i'm going to change that in a little bit just filming my mondays are still new to me so i'm always putting glasses down there because it's the day i like to read but i have to note that i have a video going live that day so i can get in the comment section and monitor them 
And then moving up to Tuesday, I wanted to start the day off with a green juice. It's been a while. I have some carrots that need to be juiced. So I um, have some lemon and some ginger because of this crazy season change. And I wanted to go ahead and do that. My to-dos for Tuesday were to do laundry, clean my bedroom, and get some yoga done. So the laundry... The little washing machine sticker comes from uh, Paper and Glam as well. I don't know if I said that that um, little juice bottle at the top, uh, sort of, I guess it's like a water bottle at the top there is also from Paper and Glam. Paper and Glam have the most unique uh, icon stickers. If you saw my plan with me from last week, you know what I'm talking about. So then I did want to take up uh, a chunk of space that day. So I put down a full box. It was a double full box, which I knew I wasn't going to use like that in the kit. So I went ahead and cut it in half. Then I went in with a half box because I had to go to my night job uh, from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. So I always use secure the bag sis of the t-shirt from Goldmine and Coco to mark when I have to do my um, night job. And then I went in on Wednesday morning with another little shake it up bottle from Paper and Glam. And that is because I wanted to have a green smoothie for Wednesday morning. I'm really trying to get better at having something in my stomach before I go to work. I usually just eat breakfast about 9 o'clock after I get to work. I'm trying to do a little bit better at that because I get up at 5 o'clock and that's a really long time to go without having anything, especially for me because by 9 o'clock I get a headache and it's just a whole production. <laughs> I'm trying to get better at that. And then I put down a piece of washi from the kit and a little girl on a laptop from, oh my goodness, Odd Loop. Odd Loop has these little girls. So I wanted to edit um, a video that I have going live on Saturday. And then I put down this little flag in the corner that I'm going to change out later for a little bit bigger flag. And the samplers that came with my Jacks and Pepper had like a little, um, some little dumbbells. And I wanted to work out Wednesday when I got home from work. And then I put down a full box to take up a chunk of time. I need to start reading a new book that I haven't finished. So for 2019, I have a ton of books in my home, you guys. A good amount where I don't have to go to the library or buy any other books. And my goal for 2019 is just to read all the books I have in my home. And once I finish reading them, I'm going to pass them off to friends and family and even to you guys if, it's, if you want to read some of them. So I'm going to finish a book. Those little glasses came from um, Paper and Glam. And then I flipped over to Thursday and start working over there i put down all of the um, date headers at the top and then i put uh, a flag in the corner to cover up the blue erin condren flag then on thanksgiving day happy thanksgiving by the way beautiful people and i put down a today banner and i wrote in happy thanksgiving in one of the full boxes that had the white out in the middle my writing is really janky but i like the way it came out so i left it like there i added those little champagne glasses that came from the sampler when i got this kit from jackson pepper then i went in with bella this beautiful beautiful doll with this kind of coral orange dress on her curves are so beautiful i love her thick little legs and she's holding a leopard print bag and that is from uh, of course, Goldmine and Coco. Where else would it be from? Um, also, I went in with a half box and a little label that said family time because I'm going to my friend Courtney's house for Thanksgiving. How sweet is it that her mom is making a pan of vegan dressing? Y'all, it was so good last year. Oh my goodness. I am so excited for Thanksgiving this year. Just to hang out with Courtney. It's been a while since I've seen her and to see her family and just to be with family, whether it's yours or not. I just think it's a beautiful thing. So that's what we're going to do on Thursday. I'm not giving myself any chores or any tasks for Thursday because I just want to be free and not be rushed and enjoy my day because Friday I have to work. Oh, yeah, I have to work that part-time job, that evening job. So on Friday morning, actually, I get paid 
so excited to be getting paid on Black Friday. I do have just a few shops that I want to shop from. So I use the girl from Odd Loop as well. She's holding money bags and that is to note payday. I went in and put down a full box that has some cocoa with leaves all around. That is a beautiful, beautiful full box. Went in with my to-do label and three tasks I want to do Friday before I go to the part-time job. And that is I want to vacuum. I want to do at least two loads of laundry and get some some yoga done before I go to work. It's more important that I do yoga than the vacuum and the laundry because I'm actually working from 12.30 p.m. until 9 p.m., which is an eight and a half hour shift because... I was like, y'all, I'm going to have to have a couple of breaks. You're going to have to give me some lunch. So I do have to work quite a long day on Friday. And it's not typical for me to do, but my um, manager asked me to do it. So I told her I would help her out. She was in a bit of a crunch. So that is why I'm struggling with the half box. The half box don't want to go down because I'm like, that's a long shift. <laughs> so... Uh, the half box I finally got down and then put in the secure the bag t-shirt. I put the little girl shopping from Odd Loop because I'm going to give myself some leeway to do some Black Friday shopping, you guys. Um, I just a few things that I want. I'm actually not buying anything I need. I'm just going to buy a few things that I want. Then I went in on Saturday and Sunday and just put blank headers at the top. Um, then... I made room for this Hello Weekend banner, which I'm not getting much of a weekend, but hey, it's still the weekend and it's a really cute sticker. So I'm putting it down and then I'm going to drop down just a little bit and then put the um, today um, headers down there to kind of mimic what's going on at the top of the other days. This was a very, very different way for me to kind of plan things using a kit like this. You guys have seen me use kits, but I, I don't know. This felt a little bit uncomfortable and it pushed me out of my comfort zone, which let me know I'm definitely in a comfort zone when it comes to my planning. So next week, I decided to challenge myself and do even more. I haven't planned that yet, but I have an idea. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> So then I went in with two more half boxes and secured the bag t-shirts because on Saturday and Sunday, I have to work from 8 a.m. until 2 p.m. on each day. Then I'm going in with quarter boxes under those half boxes because I have YouTube videos going live on Saturday and one on Sunday. And then on Saturday when I get home, so I work till 9 p.m. on Friday and have to be back in work at 8 a.m. on Saturday. So I just, when I get home on Saturday, I'm just going to sleep. I'm going to take care of Blackberry, you guys. I'm just going to get in the bed because <laughs> I know I'm going to be tired from those two long shifts. I put down an odd loop girl holding a planner because when I do wake up, I want to um, do my December budget and film it as well. So that's what we're going to do there. Sunday when I'm done working, I have this odd loop girl riding on a grocery cart. You guys, it's so stinking cute. Uh, riding on a grocery cart because I want to go to Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's is closer to my part-time job than my home. So if I go ahead and go to Trader Joe's on Sunday, that means a Monday I can sleep in. I don't have to be so rushed. My me time sticker, because we know the drill, I like to pamper myself on Sunday. We're gonna polish our nails, do a mask, aromatherapy, a therapy, film a plan with me and relax. You guys, thank you so much for spending this little time with me. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, beautiful.